Hey everybody, it's Dr. Sam Robbins. Today's Q and A is um, is about curcumin. Curcumin kills my libido, right? Is it because it increases serotonin levels? Um, curcumin is an extract from turmeric that's been linked. You know, it's most people use curcumin to help reduce inflammation. Actually, I can't technically say that. It helps support healthy inflammation in a normal range. All right, so that's what you can say legally. So that's what curcumin is used. I use curcumin. And yes, some people have said that it lowers their libido. Now, why does it do that? Now, in some studies, it actually shows it increases testosterone. So you would think, hey, that's a good thing. But then other studies have shown that if you take curcumin, you have prostate problems, it helps the prostate really well. Why? Because it does lower DHT levels, as well as even in some studies, it lowers testosterone levels. So what's the solution? First of all, if you take curcumin and you have immediately, you see some blood, uh, uh, some, some libido problems, all right? There's things you can do. First of all, you don't want to take high levels of curcumin. I never, I take curcumin, but I don't take it by itself, all right? If my goal is to help reduce inflammation or whatever, obviously diet and exercise and sleep, all those matter. But if you want to, I take curcumin with other herbs, um, you know, like ginger and astragalus and, and other herbs, and I've listed vitamins and minerals below this video, that's what I take. So you wanna take the lowest effective dose of curcumin extract, okay? and combine it with the other ones that don't have these potential libido issues and DHT hormonal issues. And now you get all the benefits of the inflammatory, healthy re inflammatory response, but without the negative side effects. And I'll put a link underneath that video. But again, you have to see how it works for you. Again, I take it, I have no problems. Most people take it, I have no problems. And some people do, all right? You have to be the judge with your own body. Always start low and then build up and see how you go. I tell people to, to every two weeks, play around with the dose. It takes about two weeks for your body to adapt. And again, take the lowest effective curcumin extract, a lot of junk out there, right? And take it with other herbs and minerals and amino acids that help. And I, post, and I posted the best uh, solutions underneath that video so you can get the healthy inflammatory response without the negative libido effect. So hopefully that was helpful. Let me know below. And as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Wishing you a very happy and healthy day.